Hi everyone. Today we're going to talk about the ways to back up Google Drive. First of all, Google Workspace doesn't have native tools to back up its services. The best practice for companies and individuals alike is to purchase a third-party backup tool as it automates the whole process and minimizes the chance of human error. If you don't have a third-party backup yet, there are some alternatives that enable you to preserve your Google Drive data. Let's take a closer look at it. The first method is a manual data download to an external hard drive. To do it, open your Google Drive. Select all the files using Control-A or manually choose those that you want to copy. Right-click and select Download. The files will be in a zip format. It will take some time. Preserve this copy in a reliable place and extract files whenever needed. The main advantage of this method is that it's free of charge. However, there are several disadvantages. It's a manual backup, so it's prone to human error, and you'll have to do it on your own regularly. It either takes up hard drive space or requires constant manual copying to other cloud services. The second method is Google Takeout. You can access this program in two ways, by typing Google Takeout in a Google search or via your account. Click on your avatar in the right corner while in one of Google's services. Ensure that you're logged in. Click Manage My Google Account in the drop-down panel. You'll be redirected to your account's page. In the left side panel, click Data and Privacy. Scroll down and find the Download or Delete Your Data section. Choose Download Your Data. You will then be redirected to the Takeout page. As you can see, we have the information about our previous exports. But if you haven't done it, this section will not be here. You'll see the section to create a new export. By default, Takeout will select all the Google services. We do not need all, so click Deselect All in the top right corner of the section. Scroll down to find Google Drive and check the box next to it. Click Multiple Formats. In the pop-up window, you'll see the types of data and the file formats in which you can download them from Google Drive. Change formats as required. For instance, we chose PDF for files and spreadsheets. You can also access advanced settings for additional data options. Click on the All Drive Data Included button. By default, all data is included. To choose specific folders, deselect Include All Files and Folders in Drive, then select the desired folders. After setting your preferences, click Choose File Type, Frequency, and Destination. Choose the download destination. Set the frequency. Archive file type and determine the maximum size of the archive file. Click Create the Export. Note, generating the export may take time, especially for larger datasets. The advantages of Google Takeout include minor automation and the option to send copied data directly to other clouds or download them onto your desktop. However, its downsides are the low level of automation and the need to download before the link expires. Lastly, to secure your Google Workspace data, you can use Google Vault. Please note, Google Vault is not a backup solution in the traditional sense. It's an archiver. Recovery from Vault differs from regular backups. We recommend using Vault primarily for specific types of data, like legal or financial documents. Additionally, you will need to set up retention policies to ensure Vault retains data. To enable Vault, navigate to your Admin Center and log in as an admin. In the left side panel, click Apps. Then, click Google Workspace. Next, choose Vault. 
On the Vault page, turn the service on by selecting Service Status. Choose On for Everyone and click Save. A pop-up will appear, prompting you to turn on the service. Note that activation might take up to 24 hours. Now, navigate to vault.google.com and set up retention rules for your data. Click Retention. Identify the Google Drive icon. There will be no default retention initially. Set this by clicking on the icon. Adjust the default retention rules as necessary, determining the duration for retention. If you're unhappy with a rule, simply delete it. The advantages of using Google Vault include automated data protection. Drawbacks, however, include a lengthy restoration process, only one file can be recovered at a time, and potential costs. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe.